thank you very much for joining us and Justin and your guidance late night have always come back from defeat we spoke about that uh, before the game you know we were disappointed in the in the scoreline last week um, and probably from the outside looking in people were probably thinking that we made a lot of changes and I mean perhaps you know, we're coming here with a weakened squad, but we were totally the opposite to that. And uh, come here with a real belief and um, a real good away performance and, a, and an excellent victory. And it was achieved, as you say, with a, with a squad that showed the strength of that squad. Spoke about again that um, you know them boys have had to wait, and we're only as good as them boys that come into the group and uh, take people's places. You know, they were they were in false changes as well. You know, we had to leave one or two behind with knocks and, and, and tight muscles so we didn't want to risk it but um, you know the, the boys that stepped in Alex Lawless you know uh, Matty Harold uh, you know Jordan McGuire Drew hasn't played a lot of football um, so I'm really pleased with some real good performances but none better than for me was the young Jaden Sweeney coming on at left back and looking assured and Quite incredible, someone's only just turned 17. He had an excellent game, but it was a forced change. How is Marvin Ekpateta? Uh We'll have to assess it. It looks like it could be ligament damage. Um, but, you know, the good thing is he's getting, he's, he's getting weight through it. So he's, he's, you know, it's not as bad as we first thought, but, you know, I think we'll be, you know, it'd be weeks. Um, that, that's the first assessment.